Natural gas is one of the cleanest, safest, most efficient energy sources available and is the preferred energy source for heating American homes and businesses. Natural gas is versatile and has helped fuel the nation's economy for more than a century. When used properly, it's one of the safest and most dependable forms of energy. There are several properties that can help identify natural gas. Natural gas is lighter than air and will rise. To demonstrate, if a balloon is filled with natural gas and released, it will float up. For this reason, Columbia Gas checks near the ceiling for natural gas leaks in a building. Natural gas is combustible when combined in the proper ratio with air and an ignition source. With proper combustion, natural gas produces a harmless mixture of carbon dioxide and water vapor. Natural gas is safe and non-toxic. Natural gas by nature is odorless. For that reason, so it can be easily identified, a chemical called mercaptan is added to it. It gives natural gas a rotten egg smell. If your pipes, inside and out, your pilot lights and your appliances are operating properly, you should not smell natural gas. If you do smell the rotten egg odor of natural gas, leave the area immediately and from a safe location, call 911 in Columbia Gas. Do not use any type of phone while in the area. Do not turn any lights or appliances on or off. Do not open windows or doors in an attempt to ventilate. Do not attempt to relight pilot lights. Stay outside until someone from the fire department or Columbia Gas arrives. Do not re-enter the house until cleared by the fire department or Columbia Gas. Here are a few things you can do to ensure the safe use of natural gas in your home. When purchasing new appliances, look for those that are designed to meet natural gas safety standards. Keep your furnace operating efficiently by regularly replacing your furnace filters. Always keep the area around the furnace clean. Never vent your natural gas appliance into the same chimney or flue with wood or coal. Use trained professionals to install and repair your gas appliances. Have a qualified professional inspect your furnace annually. Check gas appliances that require venting to make sure they're venting properly and have an adequate supply of fresh air. And inspect your chimney or flue for obstructions. Have any necessary repairs done professionally. Do not attempt to do it yourself. Natural gas has a blue flame. The blue flame means the burner is properly adjusted and complete combustion is taking place. When the air mixture is not ideal, you get a weak yellow-orange flame rather than a clean blue flame. With insufficient oxygen, the carbon dioxide changes to carbon monoxide, a poisonous gas. As long as your appliances are working properly, carbon monoxide is not a concern. Most natural gas appliances are equipped with vents or are connected to a chimney to remove combustion byproducts. This eliminates the buildup of moisture and carbon dioxide in your home. Any carbon monoxide that might be created through improper combustion would also be removed with a properly functioning vent. It's very important that vents are correctly sized and in good working condition. Most natural gas appliances have a safety valve. If the pilot light goes out, the safety valve will shut off the gas, preventing it from entering the home. Natural gas will only ignite when the amount of natural gas in the air is between 5 and 15 percent and there is an ignition source. To demonstrate, this small box is filled with less than 5% gas. When there is a spark, nothing happens because the amount of gas is below the combustion range. Next, the small box is filled with more than 15%. Since this is above the combustion range, nothing should happen. But once air starts to mix with the natural gas, it lowers the concentration to within the combustion range. Then, the ignition source sets off an explosion. Natural gas pipelines have a proven safety record. Damage by outside force, often by someone digging into a pipeline, is the largest single cause of pipeline failures. To help identify our pipelines, we use markers placed at intervals along pipeline right-of-ways. Markers display 24-hour emergency telephone numbers and might provide other identifying information. It is important for you to be aware of any pipeline markers in your community. Whether you're a professional excavator or a do-it-yourselfer, when you are planning to dig, always call 811 to have utility lines on your worksite or property marked. By law, anyone planning to excavate is required to call 811 at least 
two working days before work begins. 811 will notify all member utilities to mark the approximate location of underground utility lines, including natural gas pipelines that might be in the construction area, at no cost to property owners. Once the utility lines are marked, it is important to dig with care and respect the marks while carefully excavating around them. The tolerance zone around marked utility lines is 18 inches on each side of the utility markings and the width of the utility line. No mechanical digging equipment can be used in the tolerance zone. On rare occasions, natural gas construction using trenchless excavation may result in a natural gas pipe penetrating a sewer line. This could contribute to blockage in the sewer line. If you suspect you have a blocked sewer line, call a professional plumber so the blockage can be cleared properly and 811 so that the utility lines can be marked before any work begins. Calling 811 will verify a natural gas line is not involved in the blockage. If a gas line is marked in proximity to the blockage, please contact Columbia Gas. Indications of a natural gas leak include a blowing or hissing sound, dirt appearing to be blown into the air, water bubbling or being thrown into the air, fire coming from the ground or appearing at ground level, a dry or frozen spot on the right-of-way, dead or discolored vegetation, or a rotten egg odor. If you suspect a natural gas leak, leave the area immediately. Do not use any type of phone, do not turn off or on any electrical equipment, and do not attempt to ventilate. Warn others to stay away from the area, and from a safe distance, call 911 in Columbia Gas. Do not return until told to do so by the fire department or Columbia Gas. Property owners own the house lines. Any pipe that extends beyond the meter to appliances inside the home or business or to other locations on the property, such as pool heaters, garages, and other appliances. It's the responsibility of the property owner to initiate any inspection and necessary repair or replacement of house lines through a qualified professional, such as a licensed heating cooling contractor or plumber. If there is a buried house line pipe between the meter and your appliances, it might become subject to corrosion and leakage over time. Buried pipes should be inspected periodically. Columbia Gas inspects the pipe from the main to the meter. Visit the U.S. Department of Transportation's Pipeline and Hazardous Materials Safety Administration, PHMSA website, at phmsa.dot.gov for more information about the National Pipeline Mapping System and to view pipeline locations. For more natural gas safety information, visit ColumbiaGasOhio.com.